Good evening and welcome to the latest video tea review from LaineySips.com. Tonight I'm going to be reviewing one of my very favorite teas from Teegeschwender. Teegeschwender is a German tea company that has recently come to the United States. They have stores now in the Chicago area and they do have a website where you can order all of their teas www.teamerchants.com. This tea is their elderflower white tea and it's an unusual tea for a couple of reasons one it is flavored with elderflower Americans are generally not very familiar with elderflower as a flavor we don't use it over here a lot we do have a very good liqueur that can be found in the United States known as Saint Germain absolutely delicious stuff but uh, it's generally speaking not used as a flavoring agent in the UK in Europe you will find a lot more elderflower used as flavoring you'll find it in fizzy drinks or what we would call soft drinks over here you'll find it in cordials and liqueurs I believe there's even elderflower wine um, it will be used sometimes as a flavoring in desserts that sort of thing although my younger friends in the UK have told me that it's and eh, not as popular as it used to be I guess it's not really a with it flavoring but it is very distinctive and very delicious so absolutely it makes this tea something special the other thing that makes this tea special is that it's white tea white tea is tea that has been very minimally processed it's it's picked wilted dried it's not bruised it is not really oxidized it is simply uh, you know very simply processed and as a result um, it has a very delicate very very subtle flavor and it is called white tea because it's so the way it's handled is such that the white down on the buds of the tea uh, remain intact so the tea looks white when you have a look at it the liquor of the tea uh, may vary in color I have seen some white teas from China that have a you know, they're almost crystal clear um, other white teas will be darker in the cup closer to what you would expect a green tea to look at look to look like um, historically it has been produced in China but now India is starting to produce some really lovely white teas and in fact the um, white tea used in this blend is in fact from India and it's it's wonderful the uh, liquor in the cup is a kind of a burnished gold with a tinge of green in it the aroma is absolutely lovely um, really charming lovely kind of sweet uh, quality to it not cloying against not overly sweet but just a little bit of hint of sweetness and one of the things that I would say that because you're dealing with some some relatively delicate flavors here you want to be very careful when you prepare this tea uh, Tika Schwender recommends not heating the using he water heated above 158 degrees to make its white tea and I would agree with that because the tea will scorch easily and and give off some rather disagreeable flavors also the elderflower their flowers you they can become bitter over time so be very precise when you brew this tea and heaven shall be yours the other thing that I would say is that makes a fabulous iced tea um, every day this past summer and fall I would make a large pitcher of iced tea for my desk at work anybody could come up and help themselves the elderflower white tea was one of the most popular of the teas that I that I made people really liked it it's a very special tea so I thank you very much for joining me this evening and I'm looking forward to doing more of these reviews for you take care